Yo, what's going on guys? It's me, The Incredible Greek. Welcome back for another video. So, we've got from uh, People Are Idiots channel, Idiots at Walmart compilation. So, the legendary Walmart with its fantastic cheap prices and deals and variety of stuff that you can buy. Sounds like a dream shop, doesn't it? But, it can attract some of the weirdest most stupid and most uh, troublesome people you have ever seen. I mean, I'm glad that I don't work in a place like this, or I'm not. I mean, I'm glad that I'm not a security guard at this at this kind of like place, or like just an employee at this sort of place. Because I can imagine the amount of trouble and the amount of of hassle that you'd have to go through. Who knows, every day, every once in a while, even if it was even once in a while, I couldn't, I, I just couldn't be, I, I can't be bothered to, to deal with that crap. Which went crazy. <laughs> Mate, did you see that last bit? She got right in her face and started screaming and screamed at her. Can you, oh, mate? If I was that, if I was that employee, I, I'd want to smack her. I'd want, I'd want to at least shove her away and just give her a little slap. You know what really annoys me about uh, people. What really annoys me are is when people are not aware of their surroundings, of where they are and what they're freaking doing. Why scream at the top of your lungs, drawing all this freaking attention to yourself? Everyone's just gonna look at you and think she's she's fucking crazy. We've already been through this before, me and her. Get out. Get out. You don't tell me we what to do. We're working. We're working. We're working. I don't. Fuck Get you. Get out. Get out. What does she Get do? Get out, miss. Miss. We're working, miss. Miss. Then you need to do it again. Miss. Miss. We're working, miss. I don't give a fuck. Miss. 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 Get out. We're working, miss. Lord. My car is going away. Miss. Miss. Girl pees at Walmart. Come on. <laughs> Why are people stupid? <laughs> you fucking hold on a second. <laughs> Why are people spoil? Oh, why are people so stupid? So, well, well, I don't get it. I just, I just don't get it. It's like when I saw that clip of a woman taking a dump inside a petrol station or a gas station, just taking a dump, and now we've got a stupid little girl taking a piss inside a Walmart. Go to the toilet, go outside, go somewhere private, go around the side of the building, whatever. Why? It's so stupid. If this is on, if this is on purpose, then she is truly the, uh, a fucking idiot. She is so stupid. I don't know why they think this is funny or this is amusing. Someone's got, some fucking poor git has to clean that up. Look, what's he doing? Calling the security. She's calling the security? Yeah, she's calling the security. Okay. Oh, wow. Please tell me he drove. That's where a man's been arrested for sucking on a woman's toes at a Walmart. 
The man is Michael Brown, what? told the woman he was studying podiatry. The incident happened earlier this week when Brown struck up a conversation with a woman at the Walmart, then convinced her to try on several pairs of shoes. That's when Brown allegedly took what? the victim's foot and began sucking on her toe. Brown was arrested <laughs> on Thursday night. He's been charged with misdemeanor arrest. How did that happen? Man. Tonight, three suspects are charged know. after police say they caused thousands of dollars in damage at several Fenton retailers. The three were identified and caught after being captured on surveillance cameras using syrup, eggs, paint, and other materials just to destroy merchandise. Police say surveillance cameras Boy. at Walmart caught three teenagers wreaking havoc at the Gravoy Bluff store. They spray painted maple syrup, craft paint, and bubbles all over thousands of dollars in merchandise. Investigators say this wasn't what their a only bunch stop. of pricks. After our story aired last week, they got calls from Look. more stores to report similar damage. Did she just dump like maple syrup and all that shit inside a, a shoe? But again, why why do this? Teenage these teenagers, they're apparently three teenage girls. Why why do it? Because it's funny? Is that the only reason? Because it's funny? Because it's amusing, because you have nothing else interesting in your little perfect little lives, <laughs> you know, to you know to do something, you know, to go and do something else. Oh, what should we do today? Oh, let's go in Walmart with a bunch of tomato ketchup and syrup and spray paint, and let's just ruin all their merchandise. Cause uh, <laughs> it would be funny. I've always thought there are some people in this world who just need a good ass kicking. There are some people in this world that just need a good beating to be put in their place, to be shown that they can't do whatever the fuck they want. People do this sort of shit, and then you get a few months in prison, and then they're out within a month or two. And it's just crazy, yo. But there are teenagers out there, adults as well, but teenagers as well, who think it's funny to cause trouble and harm to other people or damage property and stuff like that. It's pathetic. It really, really is point, point blank pathetic. If I could interview all three of these girls and say to them, why did you do that? You know what their response would be? I don't know. If, if you get that kind of response from a teenager or from someone, from, from anyone, yeah, they're like, oh, I don't know. That's because they don't want to admit. That's because they don't want to admit that they're just doing it because it's because they thought it was funny. We is in Wiley World. We is in Wiley World. Walmart, low prices, baby. We are low prices, dude. He's riding a horse inside Walmart. Well, we done walked up in Walmart. Yeah, we done went off in the motherfucker snow, man. <laughs> We done walked out through the snow. Look, bro, he finna get fucked off. Look, he finna get fucked off. Look. Ah, fuck that. Hey! 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 Y'all did it. We did it, goddamn. You were masturbating in the women's restroom. My name is Beth Davis, and I witnessed it. You were naked, you had your pants down around your ankles. Oh my god. Someone stop him. Do not let him go out that door. Stop this man. Stop that man. Oh my god. I did not try to kill your son. You are crazy. You are so crazy. Yes, you are crazy. I did not put out a hit on your son, sir. I did not do that. I told him not to do it. If I had wanted it done, it would have gotten done by now. This is what I said earlier. It really annoys people. It really annoys me when people are not aware of their surroundings. You got a woman talking about whatever the fuck she's talking about in public, and talking really loudly as if she wants people to hear her. People are. So, oh my god! No one. These. Oh, no wonder this channel is called "People Are Idiots" because they really are idiots. An Albuquerque man was arrested Monday after driving a stolen shopping cart to meet with his parole officer. 
The criminal complaint says 18-year-old Michael Johnson reported to his parole officer on time, but he was riding an electric shopping cart from Walmart. When his parole officer asked him, hey, where'd you get that? The complaint says Johnson admitted to stealing it from the Walmart on San Mateo and Zuni. Now, while Johnson did make it to his meeting, some say his <laughs> means of transportation probably <laughs> were not the best idea. Ah, got it, got it. Oh, look at that big boy right there. Look at that big boy. Oh, get that big boy. Get a picture of that big boy right there. Oh, this big nigga. Oh, this big nigga. Oh, <laughs> oh, look at his ass. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> what? Why are you laying down on the floor? <laughs> this is why I wouldn't want to work at Walmart. This is why I would not want to be a security guard at Walmart. I couldn't deal with this shit. I could not deal with this shit. I could not deal with it. Even if I was just a normal employee as well, I could not deal with this crap. I could not. I, I think I'd quit within the first within the first month because I just, I, I just wouldn't be able to. Uh, it, it would just stress me out too much trying to deal with all these really ridiculous people. Look, why are you doing that? I found this video more or less frustrating than funny. I just got annoyed. I don't know why. I just got annoyed with people in this. A girl pissing in in the Walmart. Why? Just just why? It's just so stupid. It's like I said, if she needed to go for a piss, go to the toilet. Go outside, round the side of the building, go somewhere private, anywhere. But no, I'm, I'm going to sit right in the middle of an aisle and, and just and just piss my entire pa like pants. You know, then you've got people. Then you've got the people. Uh, that woman at the beginning screaming. You've got that woman on the phone as well. Screaming at the top of their lungs or shouting at the top. You know, shouting really loudly on the phone or shouting at people. Not aware of their surroundings. Causing a major ruckus. If if somebody called me up on the phone and started accusing me of, of hurting their son or, or or punching their son or assaulting someone, or whatever, I wouldn't stand there in the, in the middle of a public place or there's loads of people going, "I did not hit your son. I did not try and kill your son." Would I? Would you? Would you do that? Would you be uh, raising your voice so everyone can bloody hear you? No. I'd go to a corner somewhere, go to the, go somewhere private and be like, what are, you, what are you talking about? And then you've got people, like the woman at the beginning, screaming at the top of her lungs, causing a scene. Why? Why? If there's a problem, talk, talk to the person. Don't fucking scream at people. Screaming at people, don't, don't screaming at the top of your lungs because you've got a problem. I ain't gonna solve anything. It's just gonna cause a ruckus. It's just gonna cause a scene. And then and then there's the video of the three teenagers with spray paint and syrup and eggs and whatever going around ruining all the bloody products. If I was a, if I was a security guard in that sh in that shop, I'd want ah oh, I'd so bad they want to just just batter them. Yeah, because if somebody yeah if a security guard came along and gave all three of them girls a big a good battering. Would they, would they come back and do it again? No, they wouldn't. It's like I said, like there are some people in this world that just need a, a, a good beating. There are people in this world who just need a good beating to, to, to get the message. Because getting arrested and getting a fine and going to court and all that crap doesn't work. Sometimes just giving someone a good beating works. As cruel as that sounds. So anyway, guys, look, thanks very much for stopping by, checking out this video. I hope you enjoyed my, I guess my ranting. I did a lot of ranting in this video, um, but yeah, look, thanks anyway. Don't forget to give us, uh, you know, this video a like, share maybe, and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys later on the next video. Bye.